Academy Award-nominated documentary filmmaker Elaine McMillan Sheldon visited Highland Elementary School for her next film, King Cole, which explores future opportunities for young Appalachians as a result of the declining coal industry. Well, I, I'm excited today to see Miss Rowe in action here at Highland Elementary. The Cedar Project that she is going to be introducing to the kids today is really what we're here to document. You know, we're here to just observe the kids, how they react to this new entrepreneurial um, segment where they're able to dream up new jobs for themselves and new jobs for their community. So I'm just here actually as an observer, and the film is, is really an observational portrait of that. At Pikeville Medical Center, we believe that together we can make a difference in the fight against cancer. We are proud to have patients who have experienced successful outcomes over many years. As always, we believe in the power of faith. Pikeville Medical Center, where cancer can be defeated. During the shoot, kids were introduced to Cedar's Future of Work Student Fair, which enables the next generation of Appalachia's future to new entrepreneurial opportunities. We are going to uh, briefly go over the coal industry and how it has declined in our area. Uh, and the students have noticed that um, with some of their classmates having to move away because um, their uh, parents have had to find employment in other areas, other fields, or just to move away to continue uh, being able to work in the coal mines. Um, so we're going to uh, touch a little bit about that, and then they're going to learn what is an entrepreneur today, and uh, hopefully hone in on their skills or talents that they may have, and how they can create a business uh, or a product, um, and be able to turn that into a Cedar Fair project, um, and be able to enter that in April. As kids were introduced to two different opportunities, Sheldon says she hopes kids from our region are inspired by reasons to stay. I guess we're all born and from some one place, and this is where I'm from, and so this is a place I care about. And I live in Knoxville now, but I'm still in the region, and um, I just am invested in the future of this place and hope that there's reason for people to stay, young people to stay. I've been a young person that's left and returned and sort of boomeranged and um, am inspired by places that are looking for new ways to help kids stay. For Mountaintop News, I'm Joel Cordial.